What's up YouTube, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, we're gonna be looking at Hotwire. He is an epic outfit. He is part of the Wild Shock set. He does come with a backing triple coil. So without further ado guys, let's get this review started. So Hotwire, a pretty interesting skin. They, they used Birch's body structure again for another skin. It's like if we love that skin, why not make three of them already? So, he has all black clothing, he does have an undershirt that's yellow, and th today is his first release, so a pretty cool skin. He does have a battery pack in the front, and then he has his hands around, I don't know if that's glitch, or there's just holes inside of it, I, I really don't know. Um, then his back thing, it's a little bit too bulky for my liking. I, I it, it kind of reminds me of a generator, I guess, because he does have a battery pack in the front, so he's basically charging it. And yeah, the main feature that's actually pretty cool is his mask he does have on, and then his head is made of all electricity. I really do like that, but does he match his rarity? I honestly don't think he matches his rarity. He's just too similar to Verge since they do use the same body structure. And other than that, and then they just add a different color palette, and then his head just switched. It's still the same skin. I don't think he should be an uh, epic outfit. I think she, he should have been a rare. It is what it is. So what's my final rating on Hotwire? I'm going to have to give Hotwire a 6 out of 10. Epic Games been getting really lazy with their skins lately. They're just old skins that they just they just change one thing or another and then they just call it a day. I miss when they had creativity with their skins like the Crumpet and just so many other skins. But it is what it is. So without further ado guys, let's get these combos started. For our first combination, I am using the Moto Case back thing. I do like how the Moto Case actually sits in his back. It's very compact and it just matches the undershirt he does have on and his hands. It just looks really good in my opinion. For the Harvin 2, we are going with the Hydraulic Wrecker. I do like the Hydraulic Wrecker because it does match the back thing, but it also matches the yellow he does have on. And it's just very simplistic and just really looks really nice. For the Glider, we're going with the One Shot. He is an off gray black color, so there's not a lot, really a lot of Glider that actually match him, but the One Shot always looks good in every skin. The simplistic black look of it just looks really good. And for the contra, we're going with the retro sci-fi. I do like the retro sci-fi. It ain't lime green like his head, but it just looks really good. It's almost similar to the same color scheme. And for the rat, we're going with the mayhem. The mayhem gives it the rusted old look and it just looks really good on all weapons. So enjoy the combo. For my second combination, I am using the Dismal Cape. It's a very simplistic backling. It's basically a cape that goes all the way down to his boots. And the main reason why I like it, because in the back it does have a little opening and you can see a little bit of lightning coming through it. It just looks really good in my opinion. For the Harvin 2, we are going with the Revoker. The yellow version. I do like the Revoker, so underrated harvesting tool and it goes really good with the skin, especially because he does have a yellow head and his hands are also yellow as well. For the Glider, I'm going with the Avengers Quid Gen. It is a stealthy glider, it's very big as well. It just fits really good with him, especially because he does have that all black design and his head being basically all lightning. He kind of reminds me of Electro from Spider-Man, so the Avengers Quinch is perfectly for him. So the Contra, I'm going with the Fiber Optics, a very colorful Contra, and in my opinion, just fits the theme of the skin itself. And for the Rat, we're going with the Assassin. The silver and the black looks really good, especially because it makes all guns look realistic. So enjoy the combo. For my last combination, it's actually a pretty funny one. I do have the volatile back thing. It is a bomb after all, so you need some sort of power to actually use the bomb. So what better than the hot wire skin to power up your bomb? It does have red in the tip of the spikes, 
and you can see he does have red on himself and with the wire it just looks really good in my opinion for the harvesting tool we are going with the auto cleaver again i am focusing on that yellow on his head and his shirt and overall it just looks really good with the skin for the glider i'm going with the one shot a very simplistic glider like i mentioned before and it just goes really good with a lot of skins <laughs> this was the funny part for the contra i'm going with the string lights he is made of electricity guys so that's a perfect control for the skin itself since he is powering up all the lights and it just looks funny in my opinion and for the rat we're going with the royal air force again i am focusing on the yellow he does have on so the royal air force actually goes really good with the hardening tool in the skin itself so enjoy the combo Those are the three combinations I found so far for Hotwire. Let me know in the comments below which one is your favorite. And if you're new to my channel, subscribe. I post videos of your favorite cosmetic skins every single day. And you want to support the channel, my code is, and I'm going to get all caps to these all together. You don't have to use me, but he's a smart YouTuber that can really use the help. And with that being said, guys, I'll catch you guys on the next video. See ya.